What did you do to that table? You turned it upside down. Yeah, yeah you did. Hi, everybody. Happy Monday. We are out at the house. Gonna go run some errands and just browse the town. Take Grandma out to some stores. Come on, bud. You ready to get in? Oh shoot. Did you forget something? My jacket dropped. Oh. Here. Here. Alan, you ready to go? Uh, okay. Hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> How was school? Good. Yeah. Good. What did you do today? Um, we did science. Oh, what did you do in science? We got to look at rocks. Miss Prade has rocks. Oh. What kind of rocks? Special rocks. Oh, yeah. yeah. We can also bring our own rock, so I'm gonna do it tomorrow. You oh, can. you okay. mean the rock you picked up yesterday? No, and then maybe some of the ones that Daddy yeah. gave you. I'm, I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna do the one that's really special. Okay. Oh, okay. That Daddy said. You have to show do Grandma. Not yeah. lose it. Okay, you have to show Grandma. Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> you had PE, right? Uh huh. That was PE. Yeah, fire drill and PE. You had fire drill. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Is that all you did in PE? Was fire drill? No. Oh. What did you do? We practiced basketball dribble. Oh, oh. Did, do you know how to dribble the ball? Yes. Yeah? You're a good dribbler. Sweet. <laughs> do you like your new toy? <laughs> huh? I actually like it. You like it too? Not good. What? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I think I'm gonna do this one. Good job. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, it's got a screwdriver. And a ruler. Mm-hmm. Where do you put this in? It doesn't fit to anywhere. Boy. Yeah. <laughs> 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 good broccoli. Mm -mm -mm. See, we got chicken, broccoli, and carrots. Yum, yum. Mm -hmm. Good dinner. We got the whole family. Yeah, we're sitting here eating mm -hmm. some dinner. We're going to be finished before you get finished. Every night. Yeah. Sometimes she eats all of her food without me having to say one word to her. And then other nights, it is a battle. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. See if you can beat him. Huh? Good evening, everyone. I am in my closet right now because... Everybody's in bed, and I don't want to wake Parker up in my room. So I'm just coming in the closet for a minute to tell you guys good night and just to fill you in on a little crazy thing that happened. I'm everybody has dreams, everybody has good dreams, everybody has bad dreams. Sometimes you remember your dreams, sometimes you don't. Isn't that so weird? Like, I, I feel like there's like Oh my gosh, there's so many things I could go into about dreams, and I know this probably seems really strange, but I just wanted to like tell you guys what happened 
Um, I had literally the worst nightmare that I could have ever had in my whole life so far um, in the middle of the night. And literally, I woke up from a dead sleep in my worst nightmare. And in my dream, like, it's, it's so weird. It makes no sense. But there was, like, a burglar trying to get into our house. He made it in. I ran to my room. I got my gun. And I proceeded to shoot at him. I eventually, like, got him out of the house and shot him. And he died. Um... Then his girlfriend obviously was very upset over the whole situation, so she came after me and my family. She ended up killing Tom and was trying to kill the kids and I. And the, I don't know why I would dream such a horrible dream, but it was so vivid and like, like no other dream I've ever had. I was in my dream, but I was on the outside of my dream at the same time. So weird. And there were so many details in my dream that like, I don't even know where these came from. And so, like I said, it woke me up literally out of a dead sleep. My heart was pounding. Like I, I almost couldn't catch my breath. It was, it was absolutely crazy. And I ended up texting Tom because I just, I hate texting him late at night or in the middle of the night because I know if he gets woken up, um, he'll have a hard time going back to sleep. But I just, I had to know that he was okay. And my sister ended up texting me and talked to me for a little bit just to like, until I felt, you know, like, well, basically until I fell back to sleep. But I have no idea why I would dream such a horrid dream. Like, it scared the crap out of me. And, you know, obviously, literally, my worst fear is something happening to my kids or to Tom. And it literally was like all the bad that could happen in my life was happening all at once. And what was even worse was every time I tried to fall back to sleep right after I woke up, because obviously I was still super tired, I would start falling back to sleep and my dream would start where it had left off. And it didn't matter how many times I woke myself up, like it would not stop. It was just absolutely crazy. So it like, it, um, it made my day, the beginning of my day, just like very weird. Like, I don't know, like the feelings I had were so weird. And um, it was, it was horrible, just absolutely horrible. And I know some people believe that dreams, like your dreams mean something or it's your subconscious or whatever. I mean, my grandma and I had so many conversations yesterday that could have sparked different things, you know, to happen in my subconscious uh, to end up dreaming such a dream. But I just don't know, like it was crazy. So anyway, I just, I wanted to tell you guys about my dream because it was just insane. The other thing I want to show you is my freaking feet. You see all of those? Those are all the bites that I got yesterday. They have like, like some of them have like little pus pockets. They're everywhere. That's um, a blister from my shoes because I wore brand new shoes yesterday. Not so much, there's not so much over here. They're just on this side. This is where they were mostly. And then I've got a couple on this foot. Not, not oh yeah, they're over here on this foot. Oh my gosh, look at all of those. Those are all from the fire ants yesterday. Anyway, guys, <sighs> I'm so tired and it's late. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave you guys with that. <laughs> um, and we, of course, will see you tomorrow. So I hope you all have a wonderful evening and that you enjoyed this vlog. And we'll see you in our next one. Bye.